The city of Charlotte is committed to getting financial relief to small businesses. A couple of weeks into awarding grant money to those impacted by COVID-19, there is still more money to give. Now, I spoke with Mayor Pro Tem Julie Eisel tonight about the progress so far and now how they're trying to get the word out to more businesses that need help. In the last two weeks, um, the Foundation Shin for the Carolinas and our economic development staff have really worked hard to get the first $2 million out in grants, which is about 195 different grants, um, individual grants. We have um, just started the process of really going out into the different districts to be able to reach more businesses because that's a big part of it. A lot of businesses didn't get help from the federal government because they didn't know how to apply for grants. They didn't know what was available. And so that first um, rollout is always gonna be a little bit slower, but we still have 28 million that can be deployed through two more cycles. So we're excited about that. I understand that business owners have about two weeks left to apply and you're putting in place some new tools for them to get help in person and maybe call in as well to get some guidance. Talk to us about that. Sure, so at the YMCA's, we've got, I believe, six different locations that people can go to. If they go to our um, Open for Business website, they can see which YMCA um, locations they can go to and get help processing those applications. One of the reasons that we weren't able to deploy more money immediately is because it gave staff the opportunity to see where the hiccups were when people were applying. And some of it was simply signing their W-9 forms uh, and things like that. So we realized that people needed a little bit of help in person to be able to make uh, fill out applications and get those going. So this past week and going forward, the staff will be doing direct canvassing. Um, they will go into business corridors and knock on doors looking for companies to uh, make sure that they know about this grant program. And businesses can get up to $25,000. ISIL told me that business owners have until July 31st to apply, but if there's more money left over, they will keep processing the applications until all the money's gone. So far, she says 93% of the businesses that have been helped have been micro businesses with five or fewer employees. 60% of those businesses are minority owned. Now, if you're looking to apply for that grant money or you need guidance on how to do that, you can call 704-998-6499.